Yo, what's up guys, home? welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel. And today's video, I'm going to show you how you can create a modified desktop shortcut for Fortnite just to make sure that you utilize all your CPU cores and threads, especially mainly for Fortnite. This will ensure that you guys have maximum FPS or whatever your PC can offer, you know what I'm saying, in chapter three. And this is also a super versatile method, which means that you can also utilize it for Warzone, Minecraft, Valorant, whatever you guys just want to play in that moment. And if you guys enjoyed this content, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. This would have made so, so much. And without any further ado, let's get straight this topic. And yeah guys, what I want you to do pretty much in the first place is click on the first link in the description where you can find my own website guys. And yeah, the following pack which we're gonna utilize in today's video is gonna have exactly the same thumbnail and same name as here on the top left, just like the latest one. I obviously still have made the thumbnail, so therefore it's just gonna be here on top. It's gonna have exactly the same name and thumbnail as the current video you're watching. And what you guys wanna do then is just simply click on the post itself. You might get like a small pop-up ad, which literally doesn't matter because you can still get here on the website itself. I'm just simply gonna scroll down here a little bit until you find this download button Button, just simply click onto it and it should redirect you here to Google Drive link where you can then find this pack guys Yeah, super easy they're gonna click onto download and then you already got it on your PC I obviously already have it here and it's gonna be called CPU priority guys and what you want to do is just simply open it and actually drag like the new folder on your desktop which I already did here and we're gonna launch the program itself which is called run with affinity and what this program does is super super insane guys you can see it first of all in the first place your CPU for me it's here the Ryzen 7 5800X 8 core and you can see my affinity, or better said, my threads are 16 on this CPU. And so many people actually don't utilize all of their threads for gaming, guys. So therefore, what I'm going to show you now is, you're gonna go here onto select program, you're gonna click on these three dots, you know what I'm saying? And then you're gonna navigate here into the Fortnite folder. And it's super, super easy. For me, it's program file C. I'm actually, yeah, I'm just gonna show it to you guys. You're gonna click onto a main um, local disk. For me, it's C, as for most people, you know. And then you're gonna go here onto program files. There you should find Epic Games, Fortnite, Fortnite game, binaries, Windows 64. And in here, the main Fortnite exe is actually the Fortnite client Windows 64 shipping exe. So we just simply gonna double click onto it and you can see it's already selected. And what you're gonna do now is actually go here on the processor um, section and you can see my selected affinity is already on 16. So I have maximum thread selected for Fortnite just to make sure that we get like maximum performance. You know what I'm saying guys. And what we're now pretty much going to do guys is create a shortcut for our desktop with the affinity set to 16. So therefore, whatever game you launch or whatever program, it's gonna have a CPU thread affinity of the maximum or you like what you select here. For me, it's 16, you know, I get 16 threads on my CPU. If you have like four threads or eight threads, you're just gonna put it on the maximum itself just to ensure that you have maximum performance in that certain game or program, guys. And yeah, then you can also like name it just as you want. I'm just gonna keep it here on run with affinity because yeah, it's, yeah, it doesn't matter, you know. Then you can also like put where it's supposed to like get created on the desktop and then you go on run here and also put it to maximize and afterwards you're gonna click here on to create shortcut and you can see here shortcut created successfully and now we get here actually ourselves a fortnite launch shortcut with our affinity set to 16 which is super good now we can already close this program you could theoretically uninstall it or just like keep it somewhere here on your pc you know maybe you want to apply it also for other games and then we're just simply gonna click here onto uh, the Fortnite exit and it's gonna actually launch Fortnite with it, which I'm not going to do now because I'm recording, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, therefore this is super, super easy and actually helpful guys, as well as mentioned for other games. You can do the same for Minecraft, for Warzone. Literally doesn't matter. It will boost your FPS universally in any game, guys. And yeah, guys, this is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. This would have made so, so much. And if you still have any more questions, feel free to ask me them down in the comment section below. I try to answer as many as possible. And with that said, have a great day, have a great night whenever you're watching this. And until next time, stay awesome. I'm out. Peace. That shit too light. Big foreign, come get inside. Dame go